another targeted attack in the Kashmir Valley just about a short while ago. Terrorists have now attacked laborers, residents of other states, non-locals, but laborers in Badgam area. One laborer has succumbed to his injuries and two in total have been injured in the attack. Two laborers, poor people working there, earning their livelihood. Reminder of October killings where laborers and hawkers were being killed. This time two have been attacked in Badgam. This is the same area where uh, in Shadura, remember, where Rahul Bhatta, Kashmiri Pandit government employee, was shot dead inside his office premises, a targeted killing. And also days later, Amarina Bhatt, the television actor, social media star, was killed outside her home in Badgam. And now in Shadura, we are being told that two laborers have also now been attacked by the terrorists. Jihadi terrorists continue with targeted killing in Jammu and Kashmir and in the Kashmir Valley, just adding to the count of innocent people, harmless people, being killed and targeted, leaving behind de devastated families, orphaned children. We'll try and get more details to you, but we know, now know that at least one laborer has succumbed in this targeted attack. Sunil Ji Bhatt is now joining me live at the SAR from uh, Jammu. Uh, Sunil, absolutely horrifying and heartbreaking. One more targeted attack. What are you picking up on this case? Absolutely, Pooja. No end to targeted killings in the Kashmir Valley. And uh, this evening, once again, terrorists, you know, uh, targeted uh, non-combatants. They were laborers from uh, uh, Bihar and Punjab. And uh, it, this incident happened in central Kashmir's Badgam district. Uh, terrorists opened fire. And initially, the report that came in was that two laborers were injured yes. and they were immediately rushed to the hospital. But unfortunately, one of them... Uh, who is uh, who has been uh, you know identified as Dilkush from Bihar? He's come to his injury, injuries. So one laborer has been killed in this terror attack, while another one is injured and he is stated to be stable. He is getting treatment at the hospital. But uh, Puja, once again, uh, this is the ugly face of terrorism in Kashmir. And uh, and, and I Sunil, mean, this is the people, same area, but right, where Rahul Bhatt, Amina Bhatt uh, were also targeted and now, so it's not about Hindu, which is of course target, but it's also about Muslims trying to make their identity stand with India. It is also about laborers. What harm was uh, Dilkhush doing to anyone there in Kashmir? Absolutely, Pooja. The message from the terrorists is loud and clear that they don't want presence of Hindus in the Kashmir Valley. They want Hindu-less Kashmir Valley and even uh, members of the Muslim community who are being seen siding with India, who are being seen as part of mainstream, they are also being targeted. Uh, so clearly, you know, this is a big challenge for the security agencies as well as for the union government that this new, uh, you know, threat that has emerged of hybrid terrorism because there is no strategy to deal with this, you know, issue. Yes. So uh, tomorrow an important meeting is going to take place in New Delhi and it remains to be seen that what kind of all eyes, all eyes will now be Absolutely. on the government. Sunil, stay on with me because on our pictures, to help you understand what happened today in 24 hours. One in Kulgam, that CCTV footage. Take a look at that man who enters with a gun. We have helped circle it for you. The manager is sitting normally. Vijay Kumar, 27-year-old in Kulgam, married three months ago. A man enters points at the bank manager. He knew it was a Hindu bank manager, Vijay Kumar. He knew at what time he would be sitting there. He knew that the bank was fairly empty, not with proper security. Enters, points the gun, shoots him dead, runs away. Who was giving the information about Vijay Kumar? On the other, you have two laborers who have now been shot dead. And uh, Sunil Ji Bhattu continues to be with me, is telling me that one of the laborers' name is Dilkhush. I can, I can only imagine what this poor family would be, you know, when they'll hear this news. This man must have been earning bare minimum. His livelihood in Kashmir was not harming. Any, any clarity yet, Sunil? Uh, which state was he from? Uh, where was he working? What happened? Why were they targeted? Any, any clarity coming in? Well, uh, Pooja, as far as the information that is coming in from uh, Kashmir Valley is that, uh, that this laborer who was killed in this terror attack belonged to Bihar and his name uh, was, is Dilkhush. Uh, he was staying in some jhuggi nearby the Bricklin. He was working in a Bricklin uh, in the central Kashmir's Badgam district 
and uh, this evening uh, these uh, laborers were targeted so i mean imagine i mean what kind of jihad is this that de- that you know dehumanizes somebody yes. uh, you know that even uh, the poor laborers are targeted who have nothing to do with anything they were simply there to earn their living they were there uh, for their livelihood and even they were not spared sunil keep tracking all the latest on that because this is absolutely horrific news coming in and only now the government's political will and the society that needs to wake up and ensure that they stand collectively against terrorism